What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Vol. That's right, we're playing here with Extinction Core, having so much fun doing flips. Man, oh man, guys, how you doing today? Are you doing good? I hope so, because me. Personally, I'm doing spectacular. That's right, because last episode, we tamed up an amazing new shiny prime vulture. It is, it is gig it's gigantic. Gargantuan. It looks like it would be a boss or something. Totally cool. Look at all those beautiful sparkles. And then we also got a shiny princess. Yes, princess Anklo. Ain't she a beaut? Yep, been helping me gather up all sorts of metal. That's where we left things off. And um, yeah, we've got our very best of the best for the knockout artist. I think today we should probably kick things off. If we want to be able to start taming bigger and better alphas, we need to get our dialo to be, you know, bigger and better. So let's pack up our guys. Yup, and uh, let's head on out on our alpha. I think it'll be good. And of course, we have the alpha army. The Alpha Dilo army, so in case something happens, it's not a big deal. If we lose them, I don't want to call my dinos disposable, but you know what I mean. They're an army. They are a legion. Holy crap, what are you doing here, bro? So, let's kick things off. I've really only got a few levels into this guy. Let's get them super strong so that we can get some huge... Anyway, hopefully, huge knockouts. We also got to get this guy's health up. I did do a couple of health boosts already. Yeah, that's not bad. Look at that. 100,000 health already. Let's get that melee up and maybe even a little bit of movement speed. We'll see. We may not want to max them out because we don't want to get to the point where we're killing things. We want to be able to knock them out. But that should correspond with our melee. Oh, it feels so good. All right. Ooh, we got another one. What are you? All right. We are way better than you, bro. Let's just see. How much does that do? Oh, get wrecked. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I hope that doesn't hit through the mount. It didn't look like it did. All right, give a little bite. Yeah, baby. Come here, you little turd. Let's see if we can get... Oh, did you see to e beeline the other way? Whoa, do you see that? Can I do that too? How come I didn't get to pop up in the air like that? All right, but once we are good enough, we might even be able to get like, you know, a Pteranodon. That would be so super cool, dude. How'd I miss you? How in the crap did I miss you? Come here. Get your little butt over here. Um, Actually, we don't want to knock this guy out. It would be much better if we could kill him. Because he would give uh, special loot crap. He's going to get knocked out. Dang it! Come here, Mr. Dilo. We really don't want him to be knocked out. We want to kill him. All right, you know what? I wouldn't normally do this, but we're going to switch up. Because I, I want to get... It's an alpha. We want to get his alpha loot. Come here. Turd nugget. Where are you going? Can I pick him up, by the way? Uh, maybe? I'm not sure. Come here. I got... We got to kill him. All right. All right. We're doing good. Doing good. Yes. Yeah. See, we got an emerald from that. That's why. We didn't want to knock him out. We would lose our emerald. Go away, Dylos. Get. Get. I'm not trying to level up the vulture. We did the vulture yesterday. All right. Look at that beautiful stuff. Whole bunch of hide. Why not? Let's just grab it all. Can't go wrong there. All right, let's pack up. Boom, and let's get back on you. Ooh, an alpha trike would be really nice too. Yeah, look at that. Oh, this is glorious. Absolutely glorious. Come on, bro. All right. So let's make our way through. Um, I feel decently safe on this guy. Not too many things hit through the mount, at least that we've gone up against yet. Hey, Compy, get out of here. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe we should go up. I don't know if we're good enough to go up in the mountains against. I'm sure we could take on T-Rex and stuff. Oh, Bronto. Oh, and you know what else? Almost forgot. Let's uh, get a little bit of this into him. Yeah, that's what we need. And let's get that melee up. Beautiful. So again, we don't want to, we may not max them out, but that's doing a decent amount. All right, look at, look at the Bronto. It's an adolescent. I'm just curious. 
Oh, look at you, bro. Look at you. All right. Um, babies, for whatever reason, they don't take torpor. I don't think the same as adults do. So anyway, a little bit harder to knock out. But we're doing good, guys. We are doing good. Let me run around like this for a bit, and I'll see you back once uh, I feel like we have suitable levels. All right, guys. I have been doing phenomenal leveling this guy up. Um, Yeah, I'm not sure how much more I want him to do for damage. As you can see there, it's kind of all over the place. Oh, we got an alpha. Um... Let's just see how much we do. Let's see if I can kill it without knocking it out. Oh, it's going to get knocked out first. That, ooh, dude. What's up, bro? Oh, it's only a level 60. All right, let's pop off, get the vulture again. I, I definitely do not. Uh, crap, 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 crap. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Holy. All right. Yeah, we definitely want to be able to get the gems and all the goodies from them. Sweet. Love it. All right. Let's get you packed back up, bro. Thank you for your assistance. All right. Oh, I love them so much. Just it's an all. Ooh. Might want to check those out. Um, A lot of these prime guys actually make stuff on passive. So pretty nifty. Anyway, yeah, I think we're going to be heading back home soon, and then we can start to hunt out stuff to be able to tame. Um, I remember pygmies. Oh, look at it. It's a shiny. It's a shiny. Oh, ooh, I think it's an alpha, too. Come here, bro. Oh, good Lord. And I think it is one of the best levels you can get. Oh, come here. Come here. I got I got to get you. I got. Oh, we haven't even bit him once. Come here. Oh, crap. Get, get, get him. All right, let's chill out for a second. Let the torpor go up. Holy crap. You're going to knock me out, bro. We're not careful. All right. All right. Come here. Oh, it's going to go down. So what's it going to take to tame? Three copy. All right, not a problem. Hopefully. Oh, oh, oh. Come here. Come here. Yeah. I think we need to boost our speed a little bit. Holy crap. Come on. Get him. Oh, it's Torpor is going down. All right. Down for the count. Oh, that is awesome. Oh, he's got a little friend too. Get out of here, turd. All right. Hopefully I have comp eggs on me. Let's see here. Kibble. Compy. All right. We have five. Perfect. It said three, I believe. Two, three. Now we're going to have to sort of just nurse this guy. We do not have the stuff to starve out the uh, alphas yet. Oh, that scared me. All right, let's keep them safe. But dude, 900. This is going to be amazing for our breeding farm. So it's called a midnight alpha. I dig it. I dig it. All right. See you guys right back. All right. We are down to the last bite. Hopefully it should go soon. It's, it's always hard. I probably should have waited to throw the kibble in so we do it all at once. Oh, I am so excited. Um, Yeah, over here is usually not horrid, although we can get anything from Wyvern. Yes, Wyvern's Megapithecus and a lot of different alphas. This is still kind of like desert-ish area. All right, that is a phenomenal level. I am so very pumped. All right, what else we got around here? Oh, man. What is this? Therizinosaur. I really need an alpha Therizinosaur. That would be huge. I think we should work on more collection dinos today. I'm um, still looking for the alpha Anklo. Alpha Therizinosaur, and then like an alpha Trike or Stego or one of those would be really good. Come here, bro. Leave the poor little Jerboa alone. What is this guy? Prime Jerboa. All right. That guy needs veggies to tame. Don't have any. Well, I guess I have a few veggies. Uh, oh, look. It's a mech. Mega Pithecus. I wonder how tough these guys are. Not that bad. Oh, crap. I harvested them. So I think the deal with those guys, with the mech guys, you don't harvest them. You got to go and... 
kill them, and then press E on them and collect. That's what we found last time. You know, if we came across an Alpha Saber or something like that, I wouldn't say no to that either. All right, what do we got? Prime Jerboa, dude. Should get prime stuff. Nope, doesn't. Little Jerboas. Oh, we got some loot. We I gotta remember, the, uh, the loot drops are capable. Oh, what is that? Uh, I have no idea. Let's get this guy. I need Titan Bow of Venom. All right, Titan Bow of Venom. Titan Bow of Venom. This is sketchy. This is super sketch. All right, grab it. Nothing of interest, but I'll grab it anyway. What is up here? Oh, good Lord. Why am I running towards it? What is it? Oh, it's an ultimate Paquito, bro. 2.1 million. Oh, uh, oh no. Oh, I'm getting all sorts of uh, buffs from them. All right, we got, I think we got to get out of here. Let's go back to the base. Right stinking now. Oh, we do not want to get caught up with that guy. It would smash us like a bug. Oh. Thank goodness it was down there and not up at our same level. That could have been so bad. All right. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Say hello to your new little friend. We got it's the new best male. Wow. And it's like blue. That is gorgeous coloring. Seriously. That is super duper cool. I love it. It should be the same size as those guys. I'm just like up on a platform. Look at that. Yeah, same size, same size. Oh, it is so cool. All right, so what's our best new stat? 175 in attack versus 117. Wow, that's a huge upgrade. All right, we'll have to get that in our very best. I think we had a 901 female, which actually, you know what? I packed up the females in here, the very best. And where is it? 901. Oh, it's a male. Crap. Oh, well, it's good enough. I bet you this one has better stats and everything. All right, well, I'm going to have to get breeding with those. We already did that in an episode, so I'm not going to put you through it. But yeah, let's go see if we can find another alpha to tame. That would be epic. All right, guys, we got a bunch of these uh, mech megapithecus. Uh, let's try this again and just see. All right, so I got them. Oh, it harvested all in one go. Is there a way to not harvest you? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought I saw something. Come on. Come on, birdie bird. Let's see if I can I pick them up. I think it might be a feature of this vulture where it harvests all in one go. All right, so three of them wasted. Anyway, I'm heading out over to these islands because as I recall, I've seen quite a bit of herbivores over here. Um, over at them. Ooh, we do have an alpha RG. All right, this might be a, a easy little get. I'm hoping it's a female too. It's a shame to waste it. Yeah, look at that. Sapphires galore. Any more alphas? Alpha Ravager. Level 60. All right, let's try and get this guy. Come on. Yes. Oh, my goodness. So good. So very good. I'm so pleased that we can actually take on alphas. Well, you know, little ones anyway. All right, let's fly on out here. Let's see what's up. Is there going to be anything on the island? So... The swamp's a pretty sketchy place. We're going to have to watch out. But you know how I was talking about wanting water dinos. I think berries and capros would probably be kind of common over there. So after these islands, if there's nothing here, we'll go check on that. All right. What do we have? I think one of these is considered like the herbivore island. Might be this one. So if we can just get an alpha to pop up. Come on, alphas. I'm starting to work on this guy now a little bit into movement speed. Just see what's going on. Ooh, we got a shiny. Anything of interest? Uh, let's... Oh, 900. Phenomia. Sorry, bro. Gotta go. Got to go. All right. Anything else interesting? 
So a Stego, a Trike, an Anklo, any of these things would be good in my book. Ooh, look at... That might be uh, crops in there that we can just steal. What do we got? Oh, that's an Alpha. Oh, crap. Level 80, bro. Are you kidding me? All right, let's take him out. More important that we get those gemstones. All right, let's see what's up with these this here are these actual crops that we can harvest or is this just junk oh it's just junk i think it looks like it's you know an old crop field unless over here anything i don't know definitely maybe not a bad island to build on though in all honesty if it's all herbivores look at this little area there's so many spots in rag that i haven't checked out lately it's a nice little starter. Starter safe hut. All right, not bad. What else we got over here? Um, I guess we could settle for a non-alpha too if we had to. Well, let's just see if there's any other shinies too. Um, oh, what are you? That is in fact an alpha and it looks like it's a shiny one. So we need carno eggs for this guy. All right, anything else of importance around you? Um, should we... I think the, the Dillo would probably be the way to go for this guy. All right, not bad. Let's go ahead and... um. I wonder if I can pick this vulture up. I hope it don't crash the game or do something goofy. Uh, Yeah, I think this is a pretty safe area. All right, can I pick you up on my shoulder? I can. It's not goofy, in fact. Perfect, so let's get out our Dilo. Awesome! All right, and let's see if we can get ourselves a trike. Awesome, ooh. This guy might do some big damage. All right, we're taking it. Keep on going. Doing the bites. Come on, bro. I don't know what's going to happen when it runs. Come on. Boom! Get that venom going. Do it again. Pretty soon it's going to run. But we're doing more torpor than damage. That's the important part. Alright. Boom! Alright, maybe once or twice more. Yes! And down for the count. All right, so this guy takes 12 Carno eggs. I actually brought metal with us so that we would be able to make it as we saw fit. So metal and Carno. So that's the wrong one, Carno. All right, so what was it, 12? All right, here we go, here's to waiting. All right, guys, doing good. I've been starving it out for a good little bit. Um, hopefully this isn't counting my chickens before they hatch, but let's go ahead and make a trike saddle. Yeah, and, um, let's just see. Is this going to be enough? So it says 12 carnivore kibble. Um, we have 14, just in case. I'll take two out. Is that going to be enough? Oh, no! Did it get... I think it got hit. Oh, no! Uh, you know what? I'm going to let it wake back up. Crap. I shouldn't have let it eat at all. I'm going to let it wake back up. Um, and then we're going to knock it out again. Because that is shenanigans, man. We just got, got to be more careful with the Dilo. I think uh, the Dilo actually is a, it hits more than once. Something along those lines. All right. Come here, Vulture. This time, I, I'm just going to pick you up. Stupid guy. And of course, I fed it. I should have just checked. Actually, I still can check. Yeah, see? Oh, that would kind of ruin the whole point of it being shiny, why it's special. All right, Dilo. Just don't kill him. We got to wait for his health to regen. Man. All right, it'll take a little bit longer. I'll see you back once it wakes up. All right, guys, it's a couple hours later, and uh, yeah, I got some good news and some bad news. Um, Bad news, the trike, 
the second it woke up, it just despawned. That's a thing that happens with shinies. They only are allowed to be on the map for, um, I think it's like eight hours or something like that. But anyway, it despawned the second it woke up. I was so angry, so very angry. Um, and yeah, I didn't really know what I was going to do. I kind of jinxed it making the saddle. But um, anyway, I've been going around this island. And like I said, this few hours later, I have been grinding out everything on this island for like ever, ever. And finally, I was able to get, yes, another beautiful, beautiful alpha trike to spawn in. They do spawn over here pretty well. Um, it's not a shiny though. So it's not going to be like crazy insane levels, but on a happy note, it is at least a 600 y'all. So I think this should be good enough for us. Let's go ahead, swap back on our Dilo. Now I've been kind of like playing over, um, what exactly happened and the Dilo apparently it definitely like shoots. What do you got? What do you got, bro? Um, it definitely shoots quite a few times, like if, if you use the right click attack. So while that's a good attack for the final hit, it's better if you just do a single bite or use your own trank arrows. So <laughs> look at the shine horn. All right, come on, bro. So we're going to want to be aware of that. Also check right away. Come here, bro. In fact, I could probably just bite him out. Come on. Oh, crap. He's fast. And this is where you get into the scenario where you want to just shoot him with the ball, but it is, it's just much better if you bite him like that. All right, now let's double check. All right, this time we did not damage him. Sweet. So it should just take the Carno Kibble nine, of which I have exactly nine. Beautiful. All right, well, I still got to starve him out. So I'll see you guys back momentarily. All right, guys, we're back. I starved him out as much as I can, um, I think, without having to pump narcotic in into him. So let's hope this is good enough. Toss that in, 100%, beautiful. Oh, please be enough to fully tame. Oh, crap, it's not. <gasps> oh, I'm gonna be here pumping narcotics into him for a while. All right, not a problem, I guess. Come on, brosy. All right, so we've been able to prevent. It's going up slowly, but more importantly, we stopped the uh, the narcotic from uh, from dropping anymore. So I'm gonna have to pay close attention. This is exactly what I didn't want to have to do, but this is why it's so important that we uh, go ahead and make that special sedative narcotic. Oh my goodness. All right, it'll go up for a little bit. Anyway, I'll see you back once it's on the final bite. All right, guys, it should be. Yup, done. Beautiful. Oh, that took a bit longer than I would have liked it to, but hey, what you gonna do? Awesome, we have ourselves a trike. Let's put the saddle on, beautiful. Thank you, Mr. Dialo, you did excellent as always. Team player for sure. And scoop. All right, let's try out our new trike. Now, it will be better once we have an alpha saddle for it, which hopefully I've actually, as I've been going around this island, waiting for a new one to spawn in, I've been getting a lot of lower level alphas. Oh, but that is beautiful. I love this trike. Now, it can only do normal trike stuff with harvesting, but um, yeah, it's pretty strong. It's pretty strong and should be a good berry getter. And I love how it gets this, uh, char the crazy charge. Is there anything I've been killing off so much stuff? Come on. All right, how does it swim? Oh, it's a decent swimmer. It's a decent swimmer, like most everything in this mod, which is pretty cool. Let's see if we can find somebody. Come on, bro. And again, notice we do not have the alpha boost that we will eventually receive with the saddle. Oh, I didn't get a good charge there, but you can see how it gets more and more when I get those little bit of speed boosts. If I can do it right, we'll probably be able to do decent amounts of damage. Let's see. Okay. Wow. And again, that's before I boosted anything on it. Oh, that's so much fun. I love it. All right. Now, is this guy also 
Can I shoot off of them? No. That would have been nice. That would have been really, really nice because this guy is quite tanky. Get out of here, little Shinorn. Awesome. All right. Well, let's get it back to the base. Let's see if there's any possibility of me making it saddle. Oh, if we could only do that, that would be incredible. All right, guys, we are back and look at this beautiful trike. I, I do have to say it is gorgeous. It's got the alpha colors, but then it's got like blue, blue horns and head. I don't know. I've never seen one like it. It is absolutely amazing. Anyway, um, saddle. Good news. I think we have enough. Um, trike. And there it is, the trike saddle. So the primitive armor on a normal saddle is 20, whereas on the alpha saddle, it is actually 80. So not bad. It costs a sapphire, prime hide, prime chitin, and fiber. Beautiful. Now we can, of course, upgrade it. Unfortunately, I can't really afford to do crazy upgrades, but we might be able to augment it. We just have to get ourselves more polymer. Um. Anyway, oh, look at this guy. It's beautiful, and one of my favorite things about Extinction Core is that the alphas, the tameable alphas, actually have an alpha glow, which not too many mods actually still do. I think it is really, really cool. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's go around. Oh, this thing is going to be crazy strong. I've already pumped in 27 levels. We're going to mostly be doing attack and health into this guy. Carry weight could be another good one. But, um, yeah, this is going to be, with this charge, a decent attacker. So keeping that in mind. And then what's also nice is if I want to use this guy for attacking and then harvest separately, um, it wouldn't be bad to pair up with, like, a Therizinosaur or something where you can, you know, make sure that you don't harvest something, hop off, and then get the body with something else. You know, whatever you want to. Let's just see here. Come here, bro. Oh, I love it. All right. Um, I'm going to make my way over into, I think, probably the that one area where there's all the mantis. And let's get as much polymer as we can so we can start doing augments. I think that would be kind of huge. This also might be really good on the uh, the mech creatures. So we can be sure to harvest them. So I'll keep my eyes open. I've tried to take on a few more of those uh, gorillas. And um, apparently, I, I don't know if you can actually harvest off them. Their bodies seem to just disintegrate. Even when you're using, uh, even when you don't like do the direct harvest. We'll, we'll see. We'll see once we actually go after it. All right, what do we got up here? All right, more trikes. I thought it was another alpha. I was like, word, look at how much bigger we are than a normal trike, too. It is quite incredible. Come on, guys, get out my way. Oh, we got a turkey. Boom, dude, this turkey is beefy. Come here, turkey. Nice, getting all sorts of veggies and whatnot, too, which we probably will want to take out this guy. I don't want him to eat them by mistake. Nice, look at all them levels. And then we also have experience potions that you get from random drops in Extinction Core. So I usually like to save those up, but um, yeah, not bad. So far, not bad. Let's continue on. All right, guys, we got a couple of the mech Gigantopithecus. I just want to check this out. So if I hit him, oh, okay. His body's still there. Please let me do it. Salvage. Oh, yeah, this is the way to go. Everything else was not allowing me to salvage them. Oh, this is definitely the way to go. Oh, on our way, slowly but surely, to our very own mech creature. I think that will be so cool. All right, coming on over. Are we going to have Mantis today? Is that going to be a thing? All right, we got another one of these guys. Man, these guys spawn pretty abundantly. And boom, beautiful. And let's harvest, awesome. All right, what else we got? Come on, Mantis, show yourself. All right, we got all sorts of shenanigans, but not see, oh, there we go, we got a Mantis. All right, let's smack him. Come here, bro, boom, awesome. And then we can hop off and harvest, awesome. 
Now, we'll have to get some other guys that can harvest from them a little bit better even. But I think for now, this is good. We can also go get more of our Titan Bow of Venom. Come here, bro. Nice. And... Oh! Any more? All right. I think we're good. So I'm just going to continue with this. And then I will meet you back at the base. Ooh, you know what? I said I was going to meet you at the base, but let's just do this real quick. Um, let's do a little poo. There's a low-level dung beetle, which, believe it or not, could actually be pretty helpful for us. Let's see if we can do this. It says it'll just take one feces. Awesome! All right, we got a dung beetle for our farm. Beautiful. All right, we got to pack you up, bro. And bada boom and bada boom. In our soul terminal, we can actually do stuff with dung beetles, which will help us out for, uh, you know, for crop lots once we get to that. So just grab it while we're here. A few more manti. Bada boom and bada boom. Come here, bro. Bada boom. We got another dung beetle. All right. Let's see if I can poo again. All right. I got to wait a little bit. So I'll see if I can snag that guy up too. Maybe I can, maybe I can't, don't know. All right, still have not been able to defecate yet, but um, I don't know, over here is just such a good little area and we have an enraged shiny, which I want to go against. Oh man, you're killing all the beetles and such. All right, this will unlock more tech ingrooms as, as well as uh, give us awesome loot and sometimes even get element. All right, come on to 900. That's the highest they go. And boom. Awesome. All right, we good? I love this trike. It is so good. Oh, do you got, do you got a poo? You got a poo now. Still not ready? Come on, hurry up. Defecate, bro. Defecate. All right, guys, finally was able to defecate. So pretty cool. And taking on that enrage, check this out. Max attack and max level. This thing is a beast. Absolute beast. Uh, let's go ahead and harvest here. And let's switch up our poo over here and grab another dung beetle. All right, come here, buddy, bro. And... Oh, crap, he got mad at me. Oh, uh, I forgot that they could do that. I got too close. All right, there's another one over here. This one will be fine. All right, come here, bro. Come here. Don't bump into him. Quick, before the other one comes. Boom! All right, awesome. All right, we got to pick this guy up. And bada boom, and bada boom. Quickly, before the dung beetle gets us. The dung beetle army. All right, back to the base. Wait just one last minute. We're at max attack. We got to see what its uh, attack is doing now. And look at the amount of damage. It's craziness. And uh, there just so happens to be a pygmy over here. I don't know if we're going to be strong enough yet because it's a red one. But uh, if we could get this guy, it would give good drops. So let's see. Oh, they resist like crazy. He's fast too. Come here, bro. Come on. One more hit. Yes. And we did it. All right. Sometimes there's more stuff in them too. All right. That's everything. And you cannot harvest them or anything. Would be cool. All right. Yo. Every, I'm telling you, everything gets mad at you. All right. For realsies now. Let's get back to the base. All right, guys, back at the base. Super duper cool. Um, Now with all of our new polymer, let's go ahead and make a ton of augments. Yes, and with these augments, let's go grab our trike. We can upgrade the saddle without having to spend, you know, all the other resources that are so pricey. So this will give us a little bit of an oomph. So it's still a primitive. But let's just see all the way up to 240. Not bad. That is a huge improvement. Huge, huge, huge. All right. Our strongest creature yet, believe it or not. Yeah. Alpha Trike. I am thrilled. Uh, other things. I made another one of these terminals, which I guess we can stick back here for now. Um, Let's see. Yeah, right, right here is fine. Right here is fine for now. All right, beautiful. Let's throw in our dung beetle that we just got. And let me see, what are other things that we need to go with it? Uh, let's grab out... Let's see here. All right, we got a, a slew of uh, 
of creatures right here. Let's grab these guys that are adults. Just to use for poo. All right, awesome. Let's throw on over here now. Very cool. And if we go in here and say options, automation, we can say passive generation, miscellaneous poop, poop, and beetles convert poop. Perfect. And then later on, once we get crop plots, we can tell it, I think, to distribute the the uh, the fertilizer that we'll end up getting to the crop plots. So this will take a little bit of time, but let me hang out for a minute. All right. And there we have it. Um, the dillos do the poo and over time. And then the dung beetles will convert that poo into fertilizer and oil. And it will be all just right in this little machine. So now we have those productions. We don't need to use thatch or uh, compost bins or any of that. It will just do it all for us. So yeah, not a bad start. Not a bad start at all. Anyway, guys, um, yeah, pretty amazing day. Thank you so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As always, show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace out.